Well, coping with breast cancer. Health experts say stress management is key for the 4 million breast cancer survivors in the U.S. For breast cancer survivor Isabel Ramos Toca, healing includes tea time. It's the time that I stopped and nothing mattered except that collecting myself. It's one of several strategies she's put into practice after participating in a 10-week study on stress management at the Sylvester Comprehensive Cancer Center at the University of Miami. Here I found a voice. When I'm going to be in a stressful situation, how to catch my thoughts. It really gave me an outlet as to all the emotions. The program for cancer survivors involves support groups that meet virtually. Patients learn coping skills, breathing techniques, along with other ways to reduce stress. They show reductions in stress hormones, such as cortisol. Dr. Michael Antoni says managing stress can even lead to better outcomes for patients. Reducing stress hormones can lower inflammation and produce a better immune response. They have a longer period of time before they have a recurrence and a longer survival time. Every week on Wednesday for an hour and a half, it was like amazing. Toka says the skills she's honing, such as yoga, which she picked up from the program, have helped her regain control of her life. You don't have to um, be in a dark hole. You don't have to feel that you're a victim. She's now cancer free and hoping to help more survivors find their peace. And doctors say they are finding the program can help participants deal with anxiety, depression, and distress long after cancer treatments.